I've already done testing of the Radio Link Bime DB Gyro in the Glue and Fly Series DIY F22 Park Jet. I'll have links to my setup for this uh, Bime DB Gyro in the show notes as well as the te first test flight that I did with it, <clears throat> where it also demonstrates the the flight also demonstrates the rudder control. So what's different about the Bime DB Gyro? as opposed to the BIME D, which is also an Elevon mixing gyro, is that the BIME D does not have an active rudder channel, but the BIME DB does have an active rudder channel. So that gives you an additional um, axis of control for VTEL or um, wings or Elevon mixing uh, park jets like what I have. So um, it's going to be it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, putting this into a, a brand new airframe with full-size rudders on it to do nice hammerheads with a park jet, something I've never had before. So yeah, it also does um, dynamic PID tuning, which I assume means it does um, automatic gain control, depending on flight characteristics and I would assume also on wind conditions. So that's very nice. So what I was trying to do with this um, F-22 in this demo flight, and I, I don't have any narration during the flight. It's just a, a demonstration flight. But what I was trying to do in this flight was put the F-22 through its paces with this gyro after I got it all tuned and all trimmed. And I wanted to see if I could force oscillations from the gyro. So I, I performed... Uh, fast flight with it, slow flight with it, uh, rolls, loops, split S maneuvers, roller coaster turns, um, slow flight, straight and level, full throttle flight, straight and level, um, fast, wide sweeping turns, abrupt turns, um, abrupt changes in throttle, um, vertical climbs and vertical rolls, Immelmans, you name it. So I did everything I could think of doing with this park jet. The, the, you know, the way I normally fly when I'm out there flying hard, trying to force oscillations from the gyro. All I saw was a couple of times I saw it do, uh, you know, uh, correct for the wind when a gust came up. I never ever saw an oscillation from the gyro, which is absolutely fantastic. So... It's definitely a keeper. I definitely recommend this gyro. Um, this is the third gyro that I know of for fixed wing aircraft that Radio Link has released. The BIME A, the BIME D, you know how much I like those gyros, and I have several of them. I've got two of these Radio Link BIME DB gyros. They're, they're really, really nice, and like I said, I like the added function of being able to hook a rudder up to it, so... That's absolutely great. So anyway, here's the demo flight. I think you you can see for yourself. I pushed the I pushed the jet through its paces pretty hard. It was it was smooth the whole time, no matter what I did. Never saw an oscillation from the gyro. There'll be links to the gyro in the show notes as well. Here's the flight. <laughs> 